Look, she's all ready for her chair clinic. You look like a cheerleader, Katie. Ready to go. Negotiated rate and did all that stuff. Just kidding, what do you want to say? <laughs> they have dessert here too. We've already paid. Good morning, Katie Elizabeth. Good morning. Good morning. Look, she's all ready for her chair clinic. You look like a cheerleader, Katie. I forgot to heat clean my mascara. You forgot to what? I forgot to heat clean my mascara. Oh, it looks so pretty. I forgot to my eyeballs. Okay, well, you didn't have to. Hold on. Are you excited? Yeah. You feel prepared? Yeah. Okay. I'm just like going to play, you know? I'm excited for it. Yeah, absolutely. Like, it's not really that deep. <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah, but you'll give it your all. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, we're gonna have some quick, quick breakfast, then we're out. <sighs> All right, we made it to the parking lot. You look like a cheerleader. You do look like a cheerleader. Where do you have to go? <laughs> <laughs> That's what they do, like when they're up in the high and they go, or like, Something like that. It's like a something that you do. <laughs> Is that right? I don't know. <laughs> okay, so we're here. And College uh, you, how you be different from high school. You can't see on the other side of like over there, there is a cheerleader who is putting up the signs and it says you have cheer clinic and it has the arrows. She looks cute. She's adorable. Do you think I'm smaller than her or bigger than her? You're about the same size. And that doesn't really, I mean, you're trying to decide if she's a flyer yeah. or not? Yeah. Okay. Um, she's probably a flyer. She does kind of look like a flyer. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Guys, I don't like... Oh my gosh, it looks like I have dandruff. Well, it, Katie's peeling from um, being sunburned. It's dripping into my eyeballs. Uh, yeah, Mike said his scalp got sunburned too when we were on the trip. He needs to wear a hatty hat hat. Okay, so... Yeah, my scalp gets burned all the time, and then it makes this, like, if you rub your hand across my scalp, it goes like this. Why? Because it gets swollen. I'm pretty sure it gets swollen. Oh, jeez, Katie, that's no one, terrible. You guys never believe me. Well, you know you should wear a hat. I don't do hats. Oh, I see. Okay. Anyway, so we are getting ready. Um, or Actually, we're getting ready to wait. It's 9.02. Registration starts at 9.30. So we've got a little bit of time while we're hanging out here. And... Um, oh, purr. It's like pink. <laughs> you didn't tell me it was pink. It looks cute. It is kind of cute, actually. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. It's drying up really quick. Yeah. Oh, is it like permanent? Um, it's it's like a matte. Um, Kate doesn't really wear lipstick, so I have a little bit of lippy stuff. You didn't tell me. Well, it looks nice. Oh, you could have told me that. I don't know what they're doing at home. They're pro they might still be sleeping. It's nine o'clock. I'm not sure. Uh, Maybe they're going to church. I'm not sure. I don't rats. know. Okay, oh, now there's, it a, stupid. there's a boy cheerleader. I just walked in. No, you don't look stupid at cool. all. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, everybody's getting here. It's exciting. This is the last day of spring break. I think we mentioned that on yesterday's vlog. So. I think um, a lot of the students are coming back today. Brennan doesn't go back till tomorrow. He's on spring break as well. He'll go back tomorrow morning early. He'll fly out and he'll get... Oh, guess what? What? I might see him at the airport. We might <gasps> see him at the airport. Uh, what? No, we land it. No. We're supposed to land... Wait a minute. We might see him at the airport. Let me check the times. Because we land when he takes off. <gasps> Do I look stupid? Be honest. Oh, yes. My lips are like bright. Pink. No, you don't look stupid at all. It's just you're not used to seeing yourself with lipstick on. You really don't look stupid at all. Oh my, god. Hi. oh my god, this is ridiculous. Oh my god. 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 Oh It doesn't say no filming. No, you it's all good. All right, so we're in line. Ears we're in line waiting to check in. We're at the inside practice facility right now at the uh, University of Florida. It is Boston. It's really, cool. it's really cool. Yeah. I'm not sure if we're allowed to film, but I'll. I'll no, no. Okay. Seriously? Okay. Okay. Oh, good. Okay. Gotta go. Bye. All right. I found out we are allowed to film, so I'm just gonna film a little bit here. Kate's getting her shoes on. I know.
so you guys no, all right no, no, no. katie finished her cheer clinic and i didn't okay i'm not sure what i'm putting in here yet of that i took a lot of video i don't there's a lot of other girls there that i didn't get permission from to be in so i might do a, just a teensy teensy bit if that's what you saw of the cheer clinic i'm not sure i might not have put any in maybe it's a picture of kate not sure but anyway katie how'd it go it went great good experience yeah do you feel comfortable yeah yeah and she met some girls you're like uncomfortable right like you felt like like yeah you like you was fit. out of place yeah yeah no okay good yeah excellent do you after doing the cheer clinic do you feel like you learned some things for if you were to do it again yes absolutely and my next question is does it still solidify your desire to cheer in college yeah, I definitely still do want to in college. Yeah, awesome. Okay, well, Kate has another one coming up um, in April somewhere else. We're not sure which one. There are two she could go to. Not sure what she's going to do. Because right now she is, should we, should we tell them? She is not wanting to talk about it. Okay, mm -hmm. we won't talk about it right now. All right, see you guys. <laughs> All right, what are we doing next? <laughs> the hotel katie ate some food i finished editing and now we are going to again <laughs> so we're flying back out of orlando so we have the rest of the day we already, did our tour. we already did our tour of uf yesterday so we're gonna we have to eat dinner so we're gonna head back to the orlando way have dinner there walk around visit 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 and then go to a hotel and ski daddle tomorrow morning sound good let's do it bye do you think we can watch fireworks <gasps> yes, let's do that. That sounds like a great idea. Okay. Okay, bye. Yeah. We've been driving and driving, and here we are. We made it. Again. Day two. <laughs> Guys, I have never trip. died in this. <laughs> a little trip to University of Florida in between. Katie, you win. Nice work. <laughs> I'm so excited. I love this. Guys. <laughs> Give me the eyebrow. I love just and if i have the chance to be here i have to go to the parks as long as i'm existing here as long as i'm in the magical place on earth i'm happy so let me say this about that can i say this about that no okay there's nothing to be said okay i'm happy that's it just kidding what do you want to say <laughs> what i want to say okay. is katie yeah when I Wait, was, can I turn this around? Yes, I don't know it's absolutely. Funny. So when I was growing up, mm -hmm. we lived in upstate New York, which is very, very far away from Disney World. And it was always this place, ah! like this magical place, right? And my parents um, did take us to Disney World, but we didn't go every year. We went like every three years. So let's say I went three times growing up. Every time we left, we had first of all we had a blast. Our family, my family growing up is like our family, like yeah, just very close. so very close. And my dad loves roller coasters. My mom loves just people being, watching, yeah. just being, and the Mickey Mouse and the magic of it all. Anyway, so we would come down. <gasps> it's not eyebrows. Did you see it? What did you say? Not eyebrows. <laughs> anyway, so my point is this: so we would come down and visit, and every time we left without fail, I would cry, 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 and I would say to myself, it, it, it like hurt inside, mm -hmm. and I would say to myself, someday I'm going to live here, and I'm never going to leave. So after college, that's exactly what I did. I knew, like, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to move to Florida and I'm going to work at Disney World because I never have to leave. So for those of you who are thinking, like, you guys go to Disney all the time, all the time. Well, I'll tell you. First Mom of all, and Dad I met moved, there. I moved here. So I'm I could, a Disney so spawn. I could live here so I could be here all the time. And then, um, and then we moved away after we worked here for a bit and Mike got offered a different job, we moved away. And then, but we come back all the time. Then Mike worked for Disney, worked with Disney as a contractor for a long time. So we came down all the time and we still do. Now we have a place in Florida. So Disney is like, it's in my blood. We have so many friends that still work here. So we get to see them and it's totally in our blood. And, and mom and dad do. met here. So I'm just, oh, here, this it's, is like a, it's like a real life yes. love story. It is like a little fairy tale. Um, so what I'm saying is, if you want to come to Disney a lot, get a job here. <laughs> it's the best thing to do. It was the best okay. thing to do. Okay. Anyways, it's a little backstory of how much I love Disney World. Okay, bye guys. See you in new. One of my most favorite things. Oh, thanks, Kate. One of my favorite things to do at Disney World is discover new things, things that we haven't seen yet. And we've seen a lot, we've done a lot, but there's always new stuff. So right now we are at the Coronado Springs. We're doing a new Springs. thing. We're doing a new thing. So we have come to a new hotel called the Coronado Springs. Actually, it's not new, but this tower is new. They built a new tower. 
We stayed at Coronado Springs before when we had a birthday celebration for my dad. <laughs> but um, we're back because we built a new tower. <coughs> Pardon me. And they have this, it's now, it's 16 stories tall and they have a rooftop lounge. And we are up here and you can see everything from up here. I think it's probably the tallest point at Walt Disney World. I don't think there's anything else taller. Yeah, there is. What? It's not Everest. Do you think Mount Everest is taller? No. Taller than 16 stories? I don't think so. But I do know Mount Everest is six. <laughs> she just keeps going. <laughs> I'm sorry. Maybe I'm allergic Mount Everest is like six inches below the max height of, um, of like a thing, like so Disney World didn't want to have to put like because oh, it's a certain amount of rods, or something, you have to put a rod with a light so, to, so that oh. planes can see you. And Disney didn't want to do that because it doesn't match the theming. So they were like, we want Mount Everest to be tall, like, but not that tall. We want it to be the tallest structure in Disney World because it's like the tallest mountain. And they were like, or not like you know, yeah, in the parks. in the world, yeah, right. And, I mean, like they wanted Mount Everest to be the tallest thing in the parks because it's also Cause the it's tallest. obviously not as tall as the hotels. Right. Oh, I it's taller than everything else. Like, it's taller than the castle. Anyways, they wanted it to be, like, realistic. And so they're like, hmm, so we'll just make it six inches shorter than what they said. So they didn't have to put it on. They didn't have to do it. That was genius. Let me show you the view from up here. So that's Mount Everest over there. And then the convention center where we are. And Star Wars Land is right there. And the Tower of Terror is right there. And that's the one in Dolphin and this fun reserve and Epcot is over there but I'd have to walk to the other end of this and there's other people down there so I don't want to do that right now but there's Katie Waity. Hi Katie Waity. We have a reservation. We have a dinner reservation yeah. In like less than 30 minutes. We like have to skedaddle. Minutes, so we have to go. Okay. The day is gorgeous. It's absolutely beautiful. It's a perfect day to be We are here. doing exactly what we want to do. A little celebration after the cheer clinic. You know, I think I'm going to take long naps in the middle of the day more often because <laughs> it makes my day feel so long. <laughs> like, and then yesterday, when we went to Disney, and then I almost said yesterday because I thought I was thinking about the cheer clinic that I did yesterday. Oh, that was today. I was today. I think about yesterday when we flew in. <laughs> right. That was a long day. And then you, we did stuff in the morning at Disney, and then you slept for three hours on the way the to Florida, uh, to UF, and then we toured, which is, which is a day activity in, itse in itself. We did so much yesterday, and so much today. So, anyway. We, we are good. We are. We're very good vacationers together. So and, are and Ryan and I. Ryan and I are good okay, vacationers. Okay, okay. okay. Me. And it's so are Brendan and I, and so are like Dad and I. It Maybe it's like, me. It almost feels like you're teeing on me in front of me. <laughs> I would never. Like. So now we're going into the Beach Club Resort and we're going to eat at one of our oh, favorite places. So Wish we had smell a vision. We're going to eat at Cape May Cafe, which is one of our favorite places. We used to eat here. And they have a character breakfast. Remember that? Last mm -hmm. I think that's probably the last time we ate here. Oh, yeah, it's actually. Ah, they have the best clam chowder. Oh, my gosh. It's so good. Let's go. All right. <laughs> Katie and I have been seated. This is the Cape May Cafe. That whole buffet back there, wait, let me do this, is ridiculous. See, so Cape May is a place in New Jersey. Actually, it's right next to where we go to visit my sister in, when we go to New Jersey. And they have this. the Cape May Cafe is all about fresh seafood. So it's clam chowder and shrimp and clams and crabs and salad and potatoes and all the good stuff. What are you looking forward to eating? Crab. I don't think that's a cafe. I'm looking forward to eating the clam chowder. Okay, so maybe I'll maybe I'll have a chance to show you up there, but I'm gonna have a plate for my hands. It's very so like tense. It is very yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. This is my second round. Alright, this this is my second round. Did we film the first round? No. The first round I got cornbread, clam. Clam chowder. Oh, clam chowder. Shrimp pasta. Salad? No. Wait a minute. Cornbread. We already said that. Clams. Wait. This is, this is Katie's now. So she has This is my second strips. one. Clam strips, chicken, veggies, cornbread. And I wanted to get um, some fried fish and stuff, but we're going to go back for that. We're and back roast beef. Round two. All right, this is my round two. I got clams and shrimp. And why didn't you get shrimp? You forget it? No, I 
had it in the shrimp pasta. Oh, okay. That's enough shrimp for you? I got two potatoes. This is the clam bake. You have to have potatoes. I got another cornbread, some pasta and vegetables, and I already had my clam chowder, and it was busted, so I might go back. I might have it for dessert. <laughs> More clam chowder? No. No. Yeah. No? Across the street is the boardwalk, and they have the best They have here. dessert here, too. We've already paid for it. They have dessert. They have a little dessert thing over there. Is it out right now? Yes. This is my round three. I got salmon, fried fish, fried clam strips, roast beef, more clammies. I have John butter and hot sauce. What do you have, Katie? Lemon curd, circle chocolate Nikki, 50th anniversary thingy, Ooh. chocolate chip cookie, sugar cookie, something blue, <laughs> and something new. <laughs> I don't know what this is. It looks like a little piece of chocolate cake. I'm gonna take one bite of every one, and then mom's gonna have the other bite. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Well, it all looked too good. I had yeah, to try. I know. She came back with a sampler platter that was just ridiculous. We made it back to the hotel, finally. It is midnight, it is time to go to bed. We had such a long day, another amazing, wonderful, fun day. After watching the fireworks, we got back in the car and drove, oh, we went, no, we went shopping after the fireworks. Did we show you that? Kate, did you show your bag? I don't think Katie- No, I asked you to a bunch of times and we did it. Oh my gosh, Katie got a new bag she wanted to share with you guys. Do you want to share it? Is it too late? It's too late. It's too late. We're gonna go to bed, you guys. Literally, we're gonna get about four hours of sleep before we have to fly back tomorrow. So we're gonna say good night. Um, what made me happy today? So many things. What a huge, humongous day. Um, Katie getting to go to the cheer camp and learning so much there was awesome. Um, just spending the day with Katie was fantastic. Talking to Brennan tonight was great. We had wonderful texts back and forth among our family chat, um, pictures going back and forth of what everybody was up to, and spending, uh, eating our dinner at Disney was great, and that cheesecake at the end was fantastic. My clam chowder was excellent. <laughs> what made you happy today, Katie Elizabeth? <laughs> Hanging out with my mommy. Mm, I love you. And Disney World. I got a nice compliment from Brennan today, too. We were talking to Brennan on the phone. He said, Katie, isn't it fun traveling with mom? That's very nice. I like to hear that. Yeah. It is. Yeah. We all have fun. I like to spend time individually with my kiddos, too, traveling, and it's been a blast. I did it with Brennan. I've done it with Katie. did it with Ryan. We'll keep doing that. So, all right, you guys. Hope you enjoyed today's vlog. I'm not sure if the boys vlogged or not. It might have just been us all day long. I'm not sure. But comment below what made you guys happy today. We cannot wait to see it, and we'll see you next video. Bye. Bye. For the latest in Live Happy and It's the Donnelly's merchandise, visit shopitsthedonnelly's.com. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.